Mic check, mic check, one, two, one, two. Before I get into the predictions of UFC 199 with Michael Bisbing and Luke Rockhold, the, this video is absolute proof that dudes from California cannot talk trash. They cannot intimidate folks. Let's 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 show the evidence. It's your destiny to be my little. <laughs> destiny to be your little bitch, dude. I'm gonna be your little bitch here. <laughs> No part of you can be any. Oh, get a mic. You've got nothing going on between your ears, buddy. Right? You look good. You don't talk good. And you ain't going to find that good next week. And uh, in two weeks, you've got oh, all the pressure man. on you. You're the guy that's supposed to be the big swinging. <laughs> well, I'm coming in. I'm coming to you. <laughs> Luke Rockhold is from Santa Cruz, California. And Uriah Faber. Where's that dude at? He is from California himself, obviously. Let's listen to this dude. It's funny to think that it's been nine years that this rivalry's been going on, and uh, that I have to deal with this guy. How's Chuck here? Two to one. What? I was <laughs> <one>. oh, <man. laughs> two to one. And two to one. Dominic oh. Cruz, the current UFC bat. Oh man, these guys are just horrible trash talkers. Anyways, let's get on to the prediction. I'm gonna go with Michael Bisbing, even though I. Kind of had virtual internet beef with the guy like years ago with the Matt Hamill fight. I'm completely over it. I mean, Matt Hamill didn't really make much of a splash uh, there after that. Um, well, not that I know of. He wasn't making that many headlines. So it is what it is. Uh, man, I could easily go down that road and go down memory lane about that fight. But uh, Mike, Michael the Count Bisbing. He's starting to grow on me after like decades of watching uh, MMA. It seems like decades, but um, he's starting to grow on me. I think he's definitely the Conor McGregor before Conor McGregor was around. He's definitely the Michael Bisbing, the great British hope from England. So, he, yeah, he definitely probably ex inspired uh, the likes of Conor McGregor and some of these other wannabe trash talkers, loudmouths out there. But... Uh, Michael definitely has the, the the goods to back it up. So I'm gonna go with Michael Bisbing by decision. Luke Rockhold Rockhold seems like he's a really tough guy, even though he's not a tough trash talker. I think Bisbing's just gonna put it to him, gonna put his hands on his face and just uh, give him a good old-fashioned beat down. So the only reason that I brought up the UFC 199 is because that's the only thing worth talking about right now. I mean, look at these guys. These guys are petite. As far as being a casual fan that I am, I'm not interested in watching these petitos. These petitos uh, go toe to toe. Just not interested. I mean, look, look at the highlights. Look how lame it is. I was trying to get hyped up for it. This is Almeida Thomas Almeida. This is his highlights. He's actually a bad looking dude. Um, this freaking theme song, the soundtrack, helps him look like a badass. But if you take out the sound, there's just a little dude fighting other little dudes. He's bringing some some pop there. Um, maybe I should have a better appreciation for it. But as far as the MMA goes, I'd rather watch light heavies, the middleweights, and I don't even know if I could watch the heavyweights. But definitely the welterweight, middleweights, and the light heavies. As far as Freaking bantamweights and featherweights. Not interested. It's kind of just lame. Just well, It looks like watching kids fight. Let's see what weight class these guys are in. 135? Oh, man. This is gross. I don't want to watch it. Don't want to watch it. So that's my pick. Yeah, Luke Rockhold and Michael Bisbing, really the only two worth talking about right now as far as MMA goes. Yeah, as far as UFC I could get into the whole McGregor versus Mayweather thing, but I think that may be a publicity stunt, but it will it will produce some some dollars. So I don't know. I haven't researched it. Lots of headlines are on Yahoo.com, Bleacher Report, ESPN, but nothing on actual UFC.com reporting that this thing, this fight, this. And this circus fight is going to to manifest. 
So let me know who you think is going to win the Luke Rockhold and Mike, Michael Bisping fight. Uh, leave your comments below this video. Subscribe. And also, you know, you could talk about other stuff too. What you think about uh, uh, the UFC in general. UFC versus MMA. Mayweather versus McGregor. We could talk about that too. And then maybe I'll make a video uh, in the near future. Alright guys, peace. Peace out. Don't forget to comment, hit the like button, and peace.